Hello, you great people. So, while well, I've been out and about today, um, I was out fishing early, so I hope you've seen that video. And then I've just done a little update video, which was my last little video I've just done to let you know I'll be doing a react, uh, reaction video probably later on. If you've watched my, been watching my channel for a little while, you know I usually go sitting down by the river there when the benches are there, uh, when it's sort of spring and summer. Um, they take them away in autumn and winter because obviously the river gets up on the grass sometimes there and uh, they probably end up getting washed away. One place where I always walk past, obviously I live in the building right there, is the Bowls Club. Please don't uh, ask me um, what the uh, rules are and everything else because I've got absolutely no idea. So don't leave questions in the comments please for me on that subject because I've got no idea. But I do enjoy watching, uh, watching it sometimes because I can literally watch them uh, playing bowls from my balcony which you can probably see over there on the other side of the building. It's very, very rare actually if you look in the car park here, there's no one here. Uh, it is a Saturday, um, it's about 4.30pm now, so there's probably going to be some people uh, come later on because in the clubhouse here, they have actually got a uh, bar. Um, all I can really say, uh, and this is not being ageist, is that um, it is normally played by people who are retired, who've got time on their hands. Uh, like I said, I do not understand the game whatsoever. I've got no idea. All I know is the balls that they play with are not exactly round and they roll out a yellow ball at a certain distance on the actual green here. Um, and they've got to, I think, try and get more of their balls closer to the yellow ball, which is called a jack, uh, than their opponent, I'm guessing. But other than that, I know nothing. Like I said, it is quite nice. Uh, when I'm doing these videos down by the river there, I'm always walking past here, so the gate was literally propped open. And for once, as you see, the gate's propped open where I've just come in. And for once, there's no one actually uh, here. So I thought, well, there's no one around. And the gate is open. I thought I'd have a quick uh, quick walk around a minute. Um, the good thing with this is here is that um, the river, obviously, which I fished today uh, on the video I did, um, unsuccessfully, unfortunately, but still a good video out in the countryside, so please do check that out, yeah? Good thing with this here is it's in a beautiful spot, this bowls club, and the actual river literally runs here on the boundary fence here of the bowls club, we'll see. But the river actually literally is like right here. River Kenzie, obviously. What you see me fishing earlier on in that video. But yeah, I thought while, uh, while the gate's open, I'm out and about. I thought I'd just walk the perimeter of it. And this place literally, uh, they must spend absolutely thousands and thousands of pounds a year on uh, maintaining the bowl surface, which I'm not going to stand on. I'll probably get in trouble. I know there's no one here, but... There is houses around that can see me, so uh, I'm not going to step on it. Obviously, I'm not a member. Maybe I shouldn't even be in here, but I'm not causing no harm. I'm not walking on the green or anything like that, you know. I've just literally come in to do a video of somewhere I've not shown you before, you know. Like I said, if you want to find out more about bowls, um, then you're going to have to look at me. <laughs> you have to look at yourselves, unfortunately. I'm sorry. I know I'm not much help on that front, but uh, it is what it is, you know. Um, like I said, I don't know. I watch them most days playing and uh, I've got no idea what the rules are. One thing I will say is, uh, like I said, they spend thousands and thousands of pounds getting specialist machines in in, in regular basis to keep keep the actual green like it is, you know, super, super short. And uh, maintaining all these, what will be flower beds when it gets warm and all plant flowers in. And in the spring and summer, it is absolutely gorgeous, to be honest. I mean, look at that hedge, it's couldn't be more perfectly cut. It's nice, we've got benches spotted around here as well, um, for people to sit on and watch the, the, the club members playing bowls. I do know in my county of Cornwall, obviously, which you know I'm in, in the very, very, very far southwest of um, England, I do know that the uh, this club here, are actually, I'm pretty sure that this club are actually Cornwall County champions. Um, and looking at the actual uh, sign, if you can see it, I don't know if you can see that properly. And the one over there. I'm pretty sure this club was founded in uh, 1927, I think it was. Which is, what, 96 uh, years ago or whatever. So, it's been around a long time. 
I don't know whether the club's been on this exact look in this exact location where I am right now for that whole uh, 96 years. I guess it probably has. I'm not so sure, but um, I know it's been here quite a long time. Um, and you know, people get enjoyment out of different things. I like fishing, and some of these people like playing bowls. Um, thought I'd show you anyway, like I said, because I've been done so many videos just a little bit further down on the other side of the fence. Uh, um, sat by the river and you update videos and everything else. That I thought I'd actually for once come in here and actually just have a quick walk around the uh, edge of the bowl, bowl surface, uh, the bowl screen. Um, just for something a little bit different, a little bit new, you know, it's right on my doorstep walk my building, 30 yards over there. Anyway, please go ahead and check out more of my content on my channel and playlists of course and please do not forget to like especially subscribe and hit that notification bell see you all later and have a great day